Pardon me. More tea, Vicar. YouTube, XR2708 here, and uh, looks as though uh, tagging is doing the rounds again. Um, I was tagged a couple of days ago now by an uh, absolutely fantastic YouTuber, really good friend of mine, a uh, chap called Dog Chiper. Uh, those of you that don't know him, in fact I'm sure most of you do know him, uh, those of you that don't know him I'll put a link in, uh, in the description on, I don't know why I'm pointing that side, on that side. Uh, so uh, yeah, head over to his channel guys and uh, check him out. So Clinton, thanks very much for tagging me. This is now my fourth time being tagged. Um, probably the hardest of uh, all my tags I've had to do. Uh, trying to come up with some uh, some interesting facts for you guys. So uh, without further ado, let's crack on. I have written them down because I have got a lousy memory. Uh, first of all guys, um, those of you that... Um, saw my previous tagging videos will probably know that uh, that I've got a tattoo. Um, it's a tribal tattoo on my upper left shoulder and for Christmas this year, fact number one, uh, the wife is, uh, is is paying to have a, a second tattoo done for me. Uh, what I'm looking at getting done is a, a tribal lizard uh, which I'm looking to have done on my left hand. Um, so at the moment I'm looking to get it in that part of my hand there so some tattooists, um, certainly in the UK, can be a bit funny about tattooing people's hands. So um, if I can't get them to tattoo that part of my hand, then I'm going to look to get it done on the side part of my hand there, if not underneath here. So we'll, uh, we'll wait and see. But uh, yeah, Christmas time I'm getting a tribal lizard, hopefully, on the, uh, the top part of my left hand. So that's uh, fact number one. Uh, fact number two... Um, despite um, my dis uh, start again, despite being um, or part of the problem with my disability is uh, brittle bones. I've touched wood, only ever broken a bone once, and that was my uh, that was my right leg. So uh, I can sympathise with you, uh, Lefarius. Uh, just above the knee, apparently it's the worst place you can actually break a bone, and that was. Um, uh, called a green stick fracture, I think it was, uh, but uh, yeah, it was in plaster for several weeks while that healed. And uh, unlucky for me, it was just it happened just after I came out of hospital from uh, having quite a big operation on my hips. Um, so you know that was uh, very very much bad luck. But thankfully, uh, it's uh, it's the only time I have broken a bone in my body. Uh, fact number three. Um, I travelled, uh, went on holiday back in 2000 it was, over to America, uh, did um, a week in Chicago and a week in New York and while I was in New York I travelled on a double decker bus with Queen Latifah, uh, whether that's a, a good thing or a bad thing I don't know, she didn't, uh, didn't seem too bad when she actually finally turned up about two hours later than, um, than was scheduled in a fancy limousine. Um, <clears throat> basically what uh, what she was doing was um, for her chat show that she had at the time um, she was doing like a, a role reversal so the, the the guy that was on the Apple Tours bus so those are the the red double-decker buses that do the tours of New York uh, the chap that normally did uh, the guided tour did her chat show for a day and she came on the uh, the Apple Tours bus and did the uh, the, the, the tour of New York City as, uh, as the tour guide uh, and that was, I think that was obviously featured on, uh, on, on her chat show for, um, you know, for, for the show itself um, so, so I did get to meet her, got to speak to her, she seemed you know, nice, enough, nice enough lass so uh, yep yeah, that's uh, point number three uh, which leads me on to point number four uh, while I was in uh, Chicago it was uh, myself and my mate were looking to to get on the Jerry Springer show. Uh, obviously, Jerry Springer was much uh, much more you know um, favoured at the time, if you like. I think it was probably you know the typical outrageous American chat show, but it was probably the best of the bunch. Um, we had written off to um, to wh whoever it was that runs the shows. I think about six months in advance. 
uh, asking for tickets, but we couldn't actually get tickets. They didn't come through in time. Uh, so while we were there, I think we ran the, uh, rang the studios and we actually managed to get tickets for the Jenny Jones show. Um, so, so I have actually appeared on the, the Jenny Jones show in the audience, not, uh, not on the stage. Um, and that, um, that was an episode, like I say, back in 2000 called something like, um, what was it called? Teens Gone Bad, I think it was. And there was all sorts of outrageous teenage girls coming on to this, you know, through, through the, uh, the cubby hole at the side onto the stage, ripping the clothes off and all that sort of thing, you know, which for, 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 for me at the time was uh, pr pretty cool. Um, I was actually in, in my sports wheelchair at the, at the time. Um, and they actually sat me right next to where all of the people come through. Um, so I think three or four times on uh, on the actual TV show, you actually see me, you know, giving it loud, saying, "Yeah, come on," and all that sort of thing, uh, to these teenage girls coming on the on the uh, on on the TV screen. But uh, <clears throat> you know, re really, really enjoyed that, and I did actually get to meet Jenny Jones at the end. She came over, spoke to myself, and my friend asked us about. Um, you know what what brought us over you know had we come over especially for the show and uh, me being the cheeky chappy that i am said uh, well we'd actually try to get tickets for jerry springer but uh, but but we couldn't get them so we came to your show instead which uh, you know she found uh, pretty amusing so uh, that's uh, point number four and point number five is uh, well scraping the barrel really but uh, you know, some of you might find it of interest, is uh, my music idol is Jimi Hendrix. Um, you know, I've been a, a massive Jimi Hendrix fan for years and years and years. I've read lots of the books, the biographies, um, you know, got lots and lots of his albums, um, got drawings, you know, pictures, artwork, etc. of uh, of Jimi Hendrix and, uh, you know, he, he's, he's always somebody that I've, you know, greatly, greatly admired and, you know, if, if there was ever such thing as a time machine, I'd meet, I would love to travel back to, uh, to Hendrix's era and, uh, you know, actually go to a concert of his and uh, see him play live, so, uh, absolutely massive, massive fan of his, um, you know, it's, it really is probably for me, one of the most influential guitarists of uh, you know that's ever been. To be honest, uh, you know I do like Joe Satriani, I do like Steve Vai, etc. Uh, but for me, Mr. Hendrix is, uh, is 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 definitely the main man. So that's uh, that's my fact number five, guys. So um, as always on these ones, we do look to tag three of the people, uh, or however many we decide. So I'm now going to tag three people. Um, up to you guys, if, if you want to do a, a tag in response, feel free. Uh, if it's not your cup of tea or you know, you've done them in the past and you just don't fancy it, then obviously not a problem. So the three people I'm going to tag, um, first up is a good friend of mine, Seb, uh, also known as Half Blind Gamer. Uh, so if you'd like to do a response, uh, tag in response matey, then uh, please feel free and I'd look forward to, uh, to, to watching your video. Uh, next up, another great friend of mine, Ready03. Uh, not too sure if you've been tagged recently or not, matey, but uh, if you haven't, it would be great to see a video from you. And last but not least, a uh, good friend of mine again, a chap called Old Iron 82 uh, So again, if you don't mind, you've got the time and uh, you know, you're know you interested to do it, then it would be brilliant to see a video from you as well, matey. So, um, there you go guys, so that's another 5 facts, so that's 20 in total I've managed to provide you over the last uh, few months and uh, 3 people to tag there that um, I will put links to their channels in the in the description and uh, you know look forward hopefully to uh, seeing videos from you guys so we'll, uh, we'll leave it there, so as always guys thanks very much for watching and I'll put up another video shortly, bye for now